Hey, thanks for joining me, Randy the News Guy. Glad to have you along today. Hey, I wanted to follow up on a video that we dropped a couple of weeks ago about reputation management and using press releases for reputation management and helping to propel your brand and reputation up through the rank and on first page of Google. The other thing, though, that I want to keep in mind, sometimes you also have to manage negative aspects on reputation. So when we talk about reputation management, sometimes there's negative press or negative information that surfaces to the front page of the SERPs and you want to push that stuff down. I just had a call with somebody uh, just yesterday, as a matter of fact, talking about this very specific issue and a couple of things that I shared with him. I thought I would cut this video and share with you as well. So of course, I'm going to talk about press releases and the incredible effectiveness of using a press release to one, get your brand or your name up on the first page of Google, because when you do that, it's going to start pressing down whatever the other things were further down into the page. But I also want to talk about a couple of other things here that you can do to help alongside press releases. And I'm going to share my screen. So I just did a quick search on my brand, Randy, the news guy right? And I want to show you what happens here. So when I just do Randy, the news guy, I've got, here's my Twitter profile. Here's an addition to my Twitter profile. So it's the same profile. It's not two different profiles, but how it is listed, whatever Twitter or X, what they've done. I've got my Facebook page, obviously. And then median, uh, medium is awesome. So as I was telling the individual yesterday, I was like, listen, you really need to use some of these other high authority content sites, create content on them and build out a, a wonderful profile because you're going to get one or two, possibly even more if your articles are ranking in Medium. But Medium, look at, I've got two links coming out here for Medium. So right away for my brand, I've got two links from X. I've got a link here from Facebook, two links from Medium, right? And then boom podcast. Yes, I love podcasts. Podcasts are so effective for so many different reasons. You get great backlinks. I've got another video that we've talked about utilizing podcasts with amplifying your press releases, and we can do that for you as well. But these are terrific. And you can look at right here. I've got two different podcasts showing up. The News Guy podcast. I've got it on Podchaser. So this was on Listen Notes. This one is on Podchaser. And then here's another very fun, high authority site that if you can get this and build out a profile or shows or content that you can list on IMDB. Here it is again. Here's another great link talking about our podcast, Hot Off the Press. So we do a live stream show called Hot Off the Press every Tuesdays at 10 a.m. Eastern time. I already had an IMDB profile and was listed in IMDB. And then look at this though. I created the show as a piece of content or a show in IMDb listed the episode and here it is showing up. It's a great high authority backlink that you can get and build out a profile. And then boom, here's a press release that we did on Benzinga. I think this is a couple of months old even that we did. Here's another podcast. Here's where I was a guest on a YouTube channel. Here's a couple of other guys named Randy that are in the news. Who the heck knows who these guys are? I don't care. But then boom, here's Randy the news guy again on the news. Here's my LinkedIn profile on Randy, the news guy, right? Boom. Here I am again, right? Boom. There's another press release. So you can see between press releases and all of these other high authority content sites, you can really dominate the first page of the search engines with your brand. And a lot of times when you're combating negative reputation issues, maybe it's a bad review or somebody has put something out there that has impacted you negatively, you can do it by having some of these really strong, significant, high authority profile content sites. So again, things like, of course you want to get all of your social profiles 
profiles out there and build those up and build links to those. And a good way you can do that also is being sure when you do a press release, do a variation of your brand like Randy the News Guy. And actually, you can even use your brand, Randy the News Guy, as the anchor and then link out to one of those pro high profile social media sites like X or your LinkedIn page or your Facebook page. That way you're getting links to those and you're making that connection, your brand with those social media profiles and you're putting it out on the Serpent with content, connecting that for the search engines. So you want to use any of those social engines. You also want to use, look at some of these other great high authority content sites like Medium. Publish articles on LinkedIn as well because those articles rank very well. You can also build out profiles on Reddit and do some posts with your brand in Reddit. Reddit is getting a lot of FaceTime on the first page of the search engine. So go take advantage of that. Absolutely. IMDB, so many things. Do a podcast. There's so many different things that you can do to help build up your brand. And so when somebody searches your brand, that you've got a lot of different listings, positive listings, listings that you control via content that you're publishing, press releases that you're publishing, opportunities maybe where you're guesting on other podcasts or other YouTube channels. But these are things that will float naturally because they're very high in authority. Hey, we can help you with any of this stuff. And if you have any questions, absolutely. There's a link below where you can book a free consultation with me. Jump on my calendar. I'd love to talk with you how we can help manage reputation and give you some positive impacts. Hey, thanks for connecting with me. I'm Randy, the news guy, and we'll see you around the corner.